Hey guys, it's Ann again with What's Up Homestead, and I wanted to do just a quick short video um, about how to make hot dog chili. We used to buy chili in the can, but it's none of it is good. This is um, a quick and easy way to make some hot dog chili. So I'm just browning the ground beef. Okay, and I've got chili powder here, and I'm just just gonna put maybe. A couple tablespoons in there. I would say a couple tablespoons of chili powder and we just we just taste it and see if it's got enough in it and it probably doesn't. So I'm probably gonna put just a little bit more in here. I should take the lid off but you know, this is how I roll and I'm too lazy to do it. So I'm just going to keep sprinkling it in here. Okay, so now I'm just going to add some ketchup. Maybe a half a cup. I just eyeball it. Just to where it gets coated. Just like a regular chili would. You don't want it to be too saucy, but you don't want it to be too thick. So I think I'm going to add some more in here. And this definitely makes more than for two people. And this freezes very well, so if you have way too much for your family, you can freeze this and have it in a couple weeks when you need it. Okay, that looks good. So I'm going to get some vinegar. I'm going to use this rice wine vinegar, but you can use apple cider or white vinegar, whatever you have, and I just put like a couple dashes in there because the ketchup is sweet and you just want to balance out the sweetness of that. So I'm just going to let this cook for a few minutes and I'm going to taste it. Okay, I tasted it and I felt it needed just a little bit of more um, chili powder and I put that in there with the vinegar okay I tasted it and it's perfect it had just enough chili powder and vinegar to make it not sweet but it was a little bit tangy so once you make this you'll probably never make canned again so I hope you enjoy it and let me know below if you like it or if you like canned chili better